to Corvain's release. I make a small cosmetic incision on the wrist over the inflamed tendons. I dissect down with scissors to avoid cutting the nerves that lie over the sheath. I dissect the nerves off of the sheath and I use a small beaver blade to incise the sheath. I then cut or release the sheath going up the arm and then down towards the thumb. Once that's done, I then retract the tendons and I look for a small little subsheath where the thumb extensor tendon is. This is a frequent source of problems if overlooked. I then release the subsheath going up the arm and then down towards the thumb. I then pull on the tendon to make sure it's the thumb extensor tendon, to make sure I've gotten it. And then dissect free the cut sheath and then I back cut it to lengthen it. So then when I repair it, it doesn't constrict the tendons. I repair it so that the tendons don't sublux. This allows the wrist to be splinted for a shorter period of time. I check to make sure it's not constricting the tendons. I'm going to suture it up with absorbable stitches. All done.